Hi, I'm Becca. And I'm Jay. And we are Pallet Town Rescue. And here at Pallet Town Rescue, we are always given six Pokemon at a time. We want to get them out on the adoption floor to those lonely 10 year olds looking for their companion, much like the one you see here. But before we're able to do that, we need to separate them into two categories, and those are cats. Or dogs. Or dogs. This is Gengi, by the way, otherwise known as Genghis Khan, otherwise known as Chonkis Khan, otherwise known as Chonky Kong. He's got a lot of different names. He's about to get real mad. But before we can do anything, before we can put them in their rightful boxes, we do need to put these animals into cats and dogs. And we might need to let go our dear boy, who I love. I love him so much. All right, go play with All your right. sister. Gotta go. See ya. <laughs> All right, kids out of the room. We got work to do here. First work. off is 565, Caracosta. Caracosta looks like a cop. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a narc. This guy's going to find out if you have drugs, then tell on you. He is planting the drugs in your car right now. He's got a <laughs> vest on. He's got a fucking face mask. He's got his arms all out. Caracosta looks like a cop. Listen, okay, he's based off of the uh, old ancient turtle, Archelon, which also is the most badass name. Archelon, insane. We had, a, we had a sea monster that was a giant turtle once called mm -hmm. Archelon. Super rad. He's also very kaiju shaped. I feel mm. like he could like fight Godzilla. Yeah, I think they would definitely fight. Maybe they're cousins or something. They're a cousin. He's like, cousin, get over here. I'm going to fight this <laughs> big old gorilla. Girl, I'll put this gorilla in a headlock, all right? You, my cousin, <laughs> bite him with your powerful jaw. I don't see anything cat-like about this creature, honestly. It really? is giving dog to me. It's giving dog to Protective, you? Protective, like, mm -hmm. canine unit. Oh, but it also has droopy eyes like a basset hound. Could 100% be that. It's got very droopy energy. It looks protective. It looks angry. He yeah. kind of reminds me of Eeyore. And Eeyore was a donkey. And donkeys, donkeys are more like dogs than they are cats. They start with the letter D. So I'm putting it for D for dog. D for donk. Dong. <laughs> Going back to Gen 1, it's the pink boy, Nidoran. 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 Our cute Spiny purple boy who's made of poison. And he's also the first boy. Other than that, yes. which is so weird. We don't talk about that very often, but it is the male Nidoran, not the female Nidoran. And yeah. like, it's so weird that before they had gen differences and or gender differences in the games, uh, there was just one that was a boy and one that was a girl. Mm -hmm. Like that was part of their whole shtick was that they were gendered. Yeah. Odd. Just in comparison to like... Yeah, like why now? Like why yeah. suddenly were they just gendered? Well, you know? that was... I mean, they started laying eggs. And people had to ask questions like, why are two Pokemon laying eggs? Which one is doing the egg laying? Yes. And which one is doing the egg making? So he's a spiky motherfucker. And I think that he would be difficult to pet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but honestly, like he doesn't look spiky to me. Like he looks like a rock. Like he looks like he'd be hard. His, the way that he's drawn does not make him to me look like he's like fuzzy mm -hmm. or kind of like coarse, crazy hair. Like he looks like crystals, like a really? rock. Like he okay. looks sharp to me. He looks sharp to you. But yeah. I, I have to agree with that. He's very pointy. But very is, he, is he very kitty or is he very puppy? Um, definitely kitty, like kitten. I was thinking the same thing. It's definitely yeah. cat coded. I feel like it doesn't want to be touched. Yeah, no. No pet. No, it's okay with just like being kind of on mm -hmm. its own and yeah. maybe it'll cuddle up to you. But right. it doesn't really quite understand how to cuddle because it's still like an angry kitten. So it uses its claws a lot. And then you're just like, oh, I'm trying to be happy, but you're hurting mm, me. But it's hurtful. <laughs> so yeah, let's turn it to C for cat. C for cat. C for cat. Chandelier. 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 I, you know what? Can I just like take a second to say like, I, I know we're, we kind of hate on inanimate objects being Pokemon. Yeah. 
I like this design. If any inanimate object were to become sentient, I wouldn't be mad at a candelabra or like a chandelier. A ghost chandelier? Yeah, I feel like That's... a ghost would like cling itself to a chandelier right? for it's sure. It's ornate, it's covered in fire, like there's so much cool stuff. Go like, it's a very cool design. It's giving Phantom of the Opera for sure. It makes me want to go and play a game just so I can specifically make sure I have this guy on my team. I would yeah. love to have a chandelier on my team because it just... Ghost fire. Yeah, oh, it is. that's cool. It's a pretty cool Pokemon. Speaking of haunted shit, ghost Pokemon have the most whack Pokedex entries. Yeah. Chandelures is also very upsetting. So it absorbs spirits. So like you pass away, your spirit is in the realm. It will burn your spirit alive and leave your husk of a body to rot. But is it a cat or a dog? I think it's a cat. I think it's a cat. I think ghosts in general are just more cat. Cats are ghosts. I don't think you hear of dog ghosts. Did you know if you look into the eye of a cat, you could enter the realm of hell? Like, cats are just aligned with the spirits. I think so. Right. But why do we have to go to hell? What's with all this hell speak? I, let's just, let's calm our brains. This <laughs> one's a cat. Let's move on then. I think we need to go to something a bit more calming. A little more calming. It's knives. Knives. It's not calming. It's sharp. It's sharp as hell. Knives. I love this Pokemon so much, Do my you really? dude. Yes. I... Ponyard. Okay, talk, tell me about your love of the design because we don't have anything to talk about this animal. I just think he's like a little samurai. Like, look at him. He's a little. He's like a samurai. He's got like the helmet on. He's got like the armor, and he's yeah. got like knives. Like yeah. the, working with swords. Like knives is my dude. This is such a cool, silly Pokemon. I I it's, love knives. It's steel, it's dark, it's just blades. It's blades as a Pokemon. Do you think by that definition, it is it's being sharp, it's being pointy, it's being stabby? It's a cat. Yeah, 100% a cat. This cat. is a cat. This is very much a cat. Pokemon, right? Yeah, for sure. I think Knives is very like sassy and like independent yeah. and like ready to fuck you up if you walk past him. Like so, he's, he thinks he's way bigger than he really is. Like Knives is a cat. So are we gonna give this guy to a 10 year old? Only time will tell. I'm not here to parent. 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 Here to parent. Eek, more stabby monsters. This is Sneasler. It's from Legends Arceus or Arceus, whatever you want to call it. It's oh. up to you. So it's a Pokemon we haven't experienced yet, but we could if we wanted to. Just hint, hint, wink, wink. Um, it is. Do you want to play that game? Is that what you mean? Is that what you're hinting at? <laughs> um, so it's the evolved form of Sneasel. Uh, really cool. Uh, remember Sneasel from Gen 2? The little weasel guy, little dark weasel? Yeah. It's the evolved form of that. But that game is in the past. I know it doesn't make sense. Okay. Sneasels in this region turn into that it doesn't, monster. It doesn't have to make sense. I just it, have to remind myself of that sometimes. It doesn't have to make sense. It's pretend and it doesn't matter. It looks like a Digimon. This is this is Digimon coded. It's not a very good Pokemon. I don't know. Nothing about it is like silly. It just, yeah. It's, all, it's like a fairly like edgy cat. It's yeah. a cat. I mean, but it's definitely a cat. Yeah, like, it's a cat. This one like has cat like features mm -hmm. it is like standing cat like so mm -hmm. definitely like a cat like an alley cat that's gotten into a fight like it's got a chunk ripping out of its ear yeah it's definitely a cat for sure that was easy it's an edgelord cat let's send it out with the other edging cats what <laughs> oh all right finally we have from gen 9 uh glamora it's a rock poison thing it's awful i really do not like this pokemon design what do you think this thing even is uh, honestly it could be a jellyfish it could be a flower it could be i don't i, I have don't no know. idea like think, a squid like a fish i think the cone thing is hollow and its eyes are inside of the cone i don't know it doesn't even look like eyes to me so, it just looks like glimmers the idea is that this thing attaches itself to like the walls of caves and then it comes out and it looks like this. It looks like that on the other side. So it's a it's a fake poison plant that traps animals, Pokemon, people, and it poisons them okay. by looking like a flower that would basically create cyanide. Okay. Um it's awful. 
I do not like this Pokemon. Yeah, I, I don't just know don't. What's going on here. I just can't get down with anything like that doesn't have a face. At least, like I can get mad about like it's got eyes. Oh, but it doesn't look like eyes. Like yeah. none that does not look like eyes. They just look like yellow dots. You know what's very upsetting is that like the region champion of Gen Nine, like this is her partner Pokemon. What does it eat? I don't does know. It eat? I don't know. I don't know if it eats. That's just I it. Don't... It's a rock thing. I just sincerely don't care Other this. rock Pokemon that are just kind of like rocks with eyes have yeah. a bit more agency than this one does. Yeah, I you really know? don't care for her or him or it. She, they, he, Yeah, like whatever. I don't know what's going on here. It's weird. Yeah, it's not even I don't like get alive. It. It's, no. It's, 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 I don't know what's going on. Um, but what do you think? Dog. <laughs> Wait, really? Dog? A dog. I think the eyes give it cat energy. Okay, that's fine. Sure. I'm not going to argue about that because this one, again, it's just like, it It says nothing. Like, it gives me nothing to work with. Argument one, it's a cat. Because I think <laughs> it has more cat. Like, look at its eyes. It doesn't look like eyes to me. It looks like dots. It's on the inside of the cone. Yeah. The cone is hollow. Yeah. It's translucent. You see inside of it. Yeah, I don't like it. It looks I like didn't say you need to like it. It looks like Homestar Runner. <laughs> it does. Homestar got Runner a, is very cat coated. Got a home yeah, it's got a Homestar Runner face. It's got a Homestar Runner cat. face. It's a cat. Cat. It's a cat. I don't cat. care. It's a cat. It's a cat. It's a cat. Alright. Send to the cat box. Speaking cat of box. boxes, do you want to check out my box? Let's look. All right, we're on the box. I'm so happy to have you guys here at the box because this is for the part where we determine whether or not the cats are the cattiest and the dogs are the doggiest. So what do you think? Is this turtleist turtle a, like a dog? But he's, he's like a, he's kind of like, I think he's kind of like in here. Yeah. He's kind of like in this area. Okay, so, but like now that we're here, I genuinely think that Creamy Baby, Mareep, and the evolution of Wooloo are more dogs than, than the turtle? Nidoran and the turtle. Yeah, for sure. Okay, so we're going to move the turtle. Yep, all the way. And then Nidoran. No, no, no. Like no. right here? here? Yeah, and okay. then Nidoran, too. Nidoran is less of a dog? Or Nido Queen, excuse me. Yeah, Nido sure. Queen. Got it, got it, got it, got it. So yeah. So here? Yep. Does that, make more, does that feel better to you? Yeah, for sure. Okay, we had a quick mid-season change. Yeah. Um, but I feel like that's okay. I, I respect that. I respect that. Mid-season? This, we are no, no, we're, we're near we're, the middle. Uh, we're hoping that this is going to get faster. <laughs> we're um, nowhere near we're the nowhere middle. We're nowhere near the middle. <laughs> um, so, all right. So, Glamour is a cat in the same vein as nothing is a cat. It could go on the very end. It's it is the, worse than no, the moon. It's the moon, at least, is a moon. Cats it's are worse moon than the color. moon rock. For sure. Sneasler here is a cat. It's Straight very, to the top. Uh, it's the most cat. Yes. It's the first the gimme. Like, it's, it's a, a cat. cat. It's a cat. Like, yes. 100% it's a cat. It's a gimme. In its Pokemon, its Pokedex entry, I bet you at least one of them says cat. Nidoran, cat. It don't touch me, cat. Mm. Do we have a room for don't touch me cats? No, but it's pretty cat to me. I would say, um, I would say it's... Um, in front of the owl. Really? Yeah. Oh my god. It's a, what, a, what a wild ride. Chandelier? Also a cat. Um, is it back here with the ghosts? Or is it kind of more cat than these? It's more than the um, than that weird moth guy. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow, okay. Yeah. And an object moving above a robot moth. Yes. Who thought? <laughs> and then knives. Knives. Ponyard is uh, like right. I want to throw him here. Yeah, look. I mean, he's right by um, Kabuto. Other for knives. Sure. Men I don't trust. <laughs> these are the men I don't trust. I don't know about you, but I don't. I, I can't give these guys my wallet because no. they don't have hands. No, we um, really had dogs going, and now here we are with. Almost even split. You of have a cats whole dogs. one whole episode of just dogs. One whole episode of just cats would fix this entire thing. And we pretty much did that. We got close. I we mean, like one, we, we need, we need one more, more. and then round out. Yeah, so that's pretty remarkable. But we're finally getting there. And again, every day, every time we do this, I wonder, are we going to be equal, or what is it going to be in the very end? Speaking of remarkable things, you guys must have remarks of your own. Let yes. us know in the comment section whether or not you agree with our assessment today. Mm -hmm. uh, we are professionals, so you aren't allowed to disagree. But if you wanted to, I feel like it would be best used in the comment section. Mm -hmm. What do you think? 
I think you could do that as well mm -hmm. as hit the notification bell and subscribe to our channel so you never miss a single adoptee waiting for its home and we don't even play the Sarah McLachlan sad ASPCA song, so I mean, like, you're welcome. Yeah, I know that we hate saying the words, uh, smash the bell and hit the like button, all that good stuff. Well, you know what I don't hate is this drink. Now, if you guys need anything, please ask somebody else. Ask someone else.